Alright, trust me, I can tell you, ladies and gentlemen, foreign is not what it's made out to be, but it has its advantage. Many advantages. The greatest advantage of foreign for me is opportunity or the you kind of feel like that if you're here that you can make it you know what i mean you you have the positive uh, mind frame that you can make it there's a good chance that you will make it there's a good chance that you will earn some money and even buy the thing and have it not that you can use it as often you can't drive up and down too often because you're working most of the time and when you're done you go sleep or you go to church or the car park quite a lot but at least you have a car kind of maker you couldn't buy none at least in fine you know say you can't wear some nice clothes and you don't have to pay the full price you know what i'm saying you can't wear some nice brands that is everybody else are wear you can't buy some nice cologne and you don't have to pay the full price you know what i mean but otherwise from that you know your house you're really in your house you know what i mean there's a good chance that you can save some money because food not that expensive you know what i mean you can't spend hundred dollar or so you know what i mean and depends on your family and the eating habits of the persons in the family the age group and you can't buy hundred dollar worth of food and you can't keep it for a while you know what i'm saying so it has its advantages and disadvantages but in terms of living in terms of living it will take you a number of years of establishing yourself you know what i mean and if you and if you come a foreign when you are 30 or 40 or it's even worse because your mindset so different it even worse if you're here for you're young different until you build and you grow and you come like nothing but when you spend 30 years in Jamaica, you work in 40 years and then you go foreign, you pretty much a start over. And it and it and it it it, it mash up your meds. Sometimes persons around you don't understand the psychological impact it has on you. Because you have to pretty much start over. You think about school again. You didn't plan for, go, for spend the time at school and left one thing to the next thing at school. And you look say, you know what I mean? But if you stick to it long enough. And you're dead if a good five, six, seven years, you should be able to level out yourself. You know what I mean? And so on. And you can't get to go back to Jamaica on vacation and go to a hotel. In Jamaica, it's difficult for you to go to the hotel unless your workplace are gone. You know what I mean? But them offer all sorts of specials to people coming from foreign. So you pay little and nothing for your fee, little and nothing for your hotel room, and all them sort of things because they want you to come. But as far as living, when I go to Jamaica, I feel like some. I'm at ease. No pressure no the me. I'm at ease. You know what I'm saying? But it is what it is. To each his own, everybody have their own experience. I love Jamaica. I will always be Jamaican. Jamaican all the way. Even if I get citizenship here so in Canada, me is Jamaican. Some people can't wait to get their citizenship and fire for just dash to Jamaica and pick on them. With all these immigration laws and different different things we are changed, you might find back yourself there. There is a there is a law in Canada now. Uh, is it called a driving impaired driving law in Canada now? And this is even engine on the new cannabis act with them have way free to smoke weed recreationally. If you are found and convicted of impaired driving and cannabis is involved it can affect your status and you can be inadmissible to canada and you can go back to your yard and cannot come back for a very long time just for driving and smoking weed so you see it the weed that was illegal the government take it to make money off it them and them money friends but if you smoke it and you are not a, a citizen or resident well even citizenship can be affected but if you're just a permanent resident you can head back to your yard just look back to your yard but do not let me tell you if you leave far and go back to jamaica here can you know the health care system not, not normal it not quite there yet the security system not quite there yet you know what i mean and and government work the same way in foreign like 
like Jamaica, or sometimes I think in certain aspects, Jamaica better in terms of the government services. If you try to do certain things with certain government agencies in foreign, you don't wonder at which world you're in, if a first world or a fourth world. You know what I mean? The Jamaican government system is a lot more efficient in many ways. As far as me is concerned, foreign government is about collecting taxes. Everything else, slow. Jamaican government knows a good for the tax part, which I don't mind. <laughs> I don't mind. They're not good for collecting taxes, so I don't mind. Barrelman TV, like, subscribe, share, you know what I mean?